KFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. Currently, we've got a little bit of a mixed bag out here. We've got the uh, most of the indices are in the uh, green, the exceptions being the semis. They're off five points, so basically a quarter of a percent to the downside, not a big deal. The trannies are off about a half a percent or 41 bucks out there. Spot Volatilinix trade out to 33.64, flirting with its 50 day exponential moving average number out there. Gold is uh, off three bucks, silver is up 20. Uh, sense out here. So let's go take a look at the markets, assist you with figuring out what they're doing. So right now, today, it's just really a consolidation. I know you might be saying to me, what do you mean, Steve-O? The Dow is up 56. The S&P is up 5. What do you mean it's a consolidation? A great question out there. So let me show you. And because you want to understand, we've, we've traded up to the top of that consolidation. So you want to understand where the breakout or the breakdown would be out here. So we've already tried. The markets have tried the breakdown area. And the breakdown area is this blue line. Now, this is the NQ. 30-minute time frame out here, 98.93.75. Now, that is the low of what I refer to as the European opening range out there. You'll see a couple of uh, horizontal lines on my chart. Uh, they're in red. They're in, uh, well, I guess I got a bunch of them because I've got a couple of things turned on here. But the solid ones in uh, red, blue, and uh, black. Black represents the U.S. opening range, and that is the top of our consolidation. So in the NQ, we're looking at uh, 10.022. You'll see that we did uh, earlier this morning, we did get one close above that, but in a Stevie's method of uh, a real breakout, you'll see two consecutive bars either closing above the top of resistance or below the bottom of support out here. We had a nice Rhodes momentum indicator signal. We've had two of them. Uh, one was at about three o'clock this morning, the other at 10, 10, 30 out here. So here's our range inside the NQ. It's 10, 0, 22. If you see price trade above that for two consecutive bars on the half hour, you should anticipate a further rally. Otherwise, we're just consolidating between support and resistance. 10, 0, 22 and 93. 98.93. Now you'll see, let me pull over one of the other uh, time frame or one of the other equity future contract. Let's pull over the ES mini out here. You're going to see a similar pattern. Now price did not test the European bottom of its opening range out, but we did just test as we came into that one o'clock time frame. We did test 30, 52 and a quarter. Watch that level. Any close above that would suggest a further move higher. Otherwise, we're just consolidating between support and resistance. Steve Rhodes with TFNN. Stay tuned for the Trader's Edge if you're off to start your Thursday. Have a thirsty one. We'll see you soon.